Welcome, this is Charles Novio from Burkert Fluid Control Systems. Today I'll be showing you how to add an additional view to the Type 8098 flow wave meter. I'll also be showing you how to show four different parameters on one screen. As a standard, the 8098 flow wave comes with one view, but we can add three additional views for a total of four. So let's get started in adding a view. First, we hold down the Enter key for about a second and scroll down to Add New View. And now we have View 2 of 2, as well as View 1 of 2. With View 2 of 2 showing, what we'll do is add four different parameters to the screen. And we do that by holding down the Enter key, scrolling down to Change Layout, and the flow wave allows us to show one value, two values, four values, a trend or graph, or that trend or graph with a couple of values. Today we'll select four values. So now we show volume flow in all four quadrants. So we'll keep the upper left quadrant volume flow and change the other three. So how we do that, again, we hold the Enter key, we scroll down to Change Value, and we select the upper right value to change, hit enter, and scroll down and we'll change that to temperature. And now for the lower left quadrant, again, we hold the enter key and scroll down to change value, select change lower left value, hit enter, and we'll change that to density factor. And for the bottom right quadrant, Again, we hold the Enter key, scroll down to Change Value, scroll down to Lower Right Value, and for this one, we'll select Acoustic Transmission Factor. So now you see we show Volume, Temperature, Density Factor, and Acoustic Transmission Factor all in one screen. And remember, we can do this two more screens for a total of four. Thank you for watching today. My name is Charles and have a great day.